So, um, has somebody ever asked you, like, who are you? So what do you answer when people ask you that? Who are you? You just, you tell them your name, right? Because that's usually what they're looking for. They want to know your name. Because they want to know how to be able to talk to you, right? And, to, and to, to call you. So they call you by name. Which is really important. Because if um, I were to say, hey, Jim, would you turn? No. Hey, Chloe. Nothing, right? Right? I could go through a whole bunch of names. Right? I could go through, should I do that? Jack, John, George, Paul, Ringo, right? Um, but if I say Ethan, then you, you turn and look and you, you're expecting me to ask you a question. Our, what, our names are important. And in the scripture that we just heard, it said uh, that God calls you by name. And so it's kind of um, an interesting thing. Like if somebody knows your name, then... Uh, then you assume that they know you, or they know somebody who knows you, right? So if, if I had never met you before, but I said, hey, Ethan, you'd be like, how do you know my name? You'd start looking around, maybe see if you have a name tag on, right? But if I know your name, it means that um, I know you more than you may think that I do. And God knows your name. God calls you Ethan, and God calls you Rachel. And that's really important because that means that God just isn't out there someplace and you know doesn't know who you are, but God knows who you are, which is really, really cool, really cool. And uh, God wrote that in Scripture so that we would know that um, we are gods and that um, God knows us by name. Now, that Scripture is often read when we're talking about baptism. And baptism is uh, the thing that we do in the church where, you know, you put water on your head, right? You've probably seen that happen. And uh, maybe you don't remember when you were baptized. Do you remember that? No, probably not. I don't remember when I was baptized either. But when I see other people being baptized, then I can uh, look at them as if that's me. <coughs> And that was me when, you know, like it's a, like a video, you're watching a video, you have to like put yourself in that spot, but it's like you are being baptized too. It's uh, called remembering your baptism. And uh, during that time, we remember that God calls us by our own name. Now later on in the service, uh, we're going to do a remembering our baptism service, uh, which is sort of like a regular baptism but it, we just get a tiny little bit of water, maybe, on us, and, uh, and we get to remember that we were baptized and that God called us by name and that God claims us um, to be God. We belong to God, which is a very, very cool thing for us to do. So uh, look forward to that. Uh, remember that when the time comes that um, God is calling you by name. All right, let's pray for you. God, we give you thanks that you know us by each of our names and that you uh, claim us to be yours, that we are your sons, we are your daughters. Um, what a wonderful thing. Uh, so Lord, as we remember our baptism this morning, help us to remember what that means in our lives and uh, to be able to listen uh, for that in uh, the message that you have for us today. In your name we pray. Amen. Thank you.